real funny. However, we're gonna get right into the set. Uh, Fox vs. Paladin should be high octane. Both of these characters, while Paladin doesn't necessarily have to play in your face, the play style of Jen absolutely is. Oh my God! It's certainly one with it more aggressive. Yeah. Um, yeah, Jen comes in is not really afraid of waiting out for any opportunity that really clearly gives him an advantage. Paula has that capability though. She can yeah. definitely just come in your face and open up an opportunity where it typically wasn't open before. Ooh, okay. Oh my so, gosh, yeah. yeah the, the parry is so good to start off the bat. Just, uh, uh, honestly, it's so, so good as it's predicting where uh, Jen has been able to you know, click those buttons. However, uh, Jen's advantage has been so strong so far. We've seen every time there's an interaction between the two players, Jen is getting 30%. And this inter inter interaction here, great angle by, by Adi. Gonna be able to get back to stage. Um, so tough to get around Palutena stuff as Fox sometimes. Yeah, I can oh. only really imagine, you know, Fox is, is so much faster than Palu by any means and has to be a little bit more beatdown than she does because she has a better projectile than he does, you know. Two of them actually, all the radical and a of flame. Yeah. And gaining the, the, the up smash right there, really good for Jen in this matchup. And keeping that advantage is going to be really, really, really good for him. Yeah, we certainly are nearing that sort of dangerous percent for Fox. Um, right around like 95-ish, I believe, yeah. and their up smash rolls just start, start killing. Um, Ooh, S-Smash boat though, but Sour Spot on the ledge. Nice utilization of that by Adi. However, uh, Adi does need to start finding the stock soon because while Fox is go. so good at this percent range, Fox starts getting really not good at like 140, 130, where nothing kills anymore because there's no more kill confirms. Um, however, um, we're going right back into it. Essentially even percents at this point in time. Both these characters can rack up the damage off of one interaction. Um, and we're seeing that right now with Palu in, in favor uh, in favor of Jen right now. Having 66% on Odyssey is a really good amount of extra credit that they're going to be wanting to use once they get that stock off of uh, mm. off of Odyssey. And give me another up air juggle. Yeah, yes, sir. absolutely. Yeah, and Adi attempted a stall there with the shine, which was yep. really solid. But you saw Jen was so patient, did not burn the double jump until he absolutely had to. And now in a position where we're ledge trapping Fox. Fox. While it has some decent mix up off the stage of ledge, certainly can get some trouble against characters ledge trapping is as strong as Palutena's. However, Adi has responded a lot of these times being put in disadvantage with aggressive options. You saw the fair right there at a disadvantage, whether I'm mis or not, ends up netting him the stock just from the shock of, you know, you know. Jen is not expecting fair at a disadvantage. Uh, by any means by Fox. Okay, looking for that double back here. Gonna miss it there. I was Dash not attack. getting any of that from Odyssey. Wow, incredible player. I've seen so much of Odyssey's right, matches already so far, and he's a great player. Ooh. Is this, yes, okay, just playing right through Paulo Dare, going right with the Firefox, up back to the stage. And Fi might be seeing a... Yeah, Firefox yeah, yeah, yeah. Fire is one of those moves that, like, it, when it's st on startup, it's, like, atrocious, because, like, you just, you, like, hit it. Yeah, you uh, stay there. Uh, when, when it's active, though, good luck. Uh, that move is, is hard to interrupt a lot of the time if you don't have this joint. Um, okay, that Nair's huge. Ooh. Just missed time the, uh, the, uh, the up smash with it. Might be getting killed for it, but this back throw system missing the explosive flame. Jen not setting the, uh, the shine back to stage. Okay, the, those Nairs are so big. Just putting Palutena into the corner is so big. We know how good Fox's ledge trapping is. Back air nice. though, defensive drift back back air by Jen using the fair. Does Adi, and then an excellent angle to get around that down tilt. That down tilt is super duper active. Tough for Fox to get around. Adi did such a great job. That Nair not true comboing into up, up smash just yet. However, with all this rage, careful. it might be tough. Okay, F throw or up throw? Not enough just yet. It had been back throw, absolutely, uh, from that side. Okay. Oh, that is a risky move to throw out. That move has lag. <sighs> all right, though, we're back. Okay, so we're double nearing. Back to the ground now is Jen. Maintaining stage control. Dash attack oh, on the wow. run-in. Yep. And there is so much risk to that dash attack. Like, both players have been dash shielding, dashing around each other a whole bunch. If Adi runs in and dash shields instead of just dashing back and forth, um, you die. That's, that's up smash out of shield, right? You simply die. And you see, like, Adi did a couple dash backs. You, Jen anticipates another dash back there, and that allows Odyssey to take the stock. Or rather, sorry, vice versa. Yeah, Jen yeah, anticipates yeah. Adi dashing back and allows Jen to get the stock with the dash attack. Yeah, this wasn't expecting the, the dash attack into, the, into his dash forward. So really good for Jen for recognizing that pattern that Adi, Adi kept doing. Uh, going over to Battlefield rather than PS2. 
Definitely a better choice. I mean, yeah. it's, it's a double-edged sword. It goes really well for both characters anyway. You know, we've seen Palu absolutely dominate on this stage because of the platform senses she gets on her upper juggles. Yeah. And Fox has a lot more space to, renew to recover, has a lot more spaces to just kind of run around and avoid a lot of uh, incoming attacks from his opponent. Yeah, let's not forget. Uh, Fox's platform extensions on the stage are absurd. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Fox has always loved triplats since four. Um, I can't really attest to Brawl, but I imagine he liked them in Brawl. <laughs> um, Fo Fox certainly has the ability to pressure platforms really well from the get just because of fast frame data and moves that are not particularly negative. But um, on top of that, Fox just gets crazy extensions off of these as well. The utilization of Fair by Adi off the stage has been really, really good to get out of disadvantage. And now, Adi back in advantage himself, and you're seeing just the pressure that Fox can put on those platforms. Yeah, I see. I like it. I was getting the, the end hit of the Infusive Flame by just dropping shield. A little bit too early there. The Jen not able to get any of these upgrades from, that he's looking for mm. off the platform, but finally getting it as he's expecting. And Adi... Just avoiding everything that Jen just pulled, just threw out at him by uh, deciding on the stage. Row. That's enough against and Fox. I was about yep. to say, that's enough. 96 at the absolute edge of the stage is going to be enough. Excellent parry by Jen. It's so tough to get out of out of the corner against Fox in a situation where he's just mixing up the timing on your bears. You know, to catch, jump to catch, whatever. A lot of time you have really to good. parry the bear. Oh, that killed. That yep. killed. Wow. Wait. Hold on. Hold on. Whoa. So we're we're we at, uh, two stuck <laughs> two stuck in screen. Uh, Advantage from Jen and Odyssey has his last stock of the winner. Oh my gosh. Wow, that's amazing. Yeah, that was really early. Oh my god. They gained the down two off the side <laughs> beat recovery and then just the back. Yeah, that was it. Boom. That's the second stock. Gone. Okay, and now you're seeing Jen really hasn't taken much percent at all. Oh. That up throw was like one of the first times we've seen really much of anything. Looking for a tech chase there, Adi not able to react in time with a down smash. Looking for the dare there, Jen not able to hit it. Um, but however, Jen is in such a great position here. Look, at this point, all you're looking for is trades, and Jen has been doing so much more than that. Back air, don't be fooled, obviously, that move's not going to kill. Um, okay, we're narrowing out of the corner. Jen once again back in advantage. The neutral gets reset there, though, and Adi's going to be able to get the stock with the back air. Um, however, Adi is in desperation mode right now. Has to get, like, big damage off of this advantage state here. Yeah, okay. like you were saying, Adi, honestly, Adi is at a really bad state right now. Under 11%, last stock against someone like, okay. like Jen, where Paulo can take so much, just do really whatever she wants. Not that uh, Fox is at a really successful kill percentage. Back this, row. No, not yet. Yeah. There it is. Just You're waiting on that, that uh, the delay from the initial startup frames from uh, for Firefox, and then just... Just coming in with it with the back air. Yeah, and obviously you're fully invincible on yep. the whole back half of Palu there, so there's no risk to that whatsoever. Yeah. Um, and really, just a, a display of dominance by Jen, who, if I remember correctly, won last week. Yes, yes. So um, keeping that up, uh, quick back air once the double jump was um, expended, and you know just able to take that stock. Kind of crazy advantage states uh, that that second stock and that third stock by Jen. Just being able to so consistently catch. Uh, a, ca a character like Fox, as fast as Fox is, out of disadvantage and just making it look easy. You know, catching double jumps, making those reads, which are definitely tough to make. Obviously, Fox can struggle to get back to stage, and Palu is one of the best characters because of lingering hitboxes and invincible hitboxes that make it really, really tough for Fox. Mm -hmm. um, like, Palu, or rather, Jen in general, has just done an excellent job of maintaining that advantage state pretty much the entire set. I feel like I just got schooled. <laughs>